621. That's how much subscribers we have right now. And that's my birth date. 621 is my magic number. You know, I've been seeing that number a lot. A lot of synchronicities been being sent to me, you know, from all different types of energies I don't even know about. But they're trying to tell me something. I'm trying to figure out what I got to do, how to find my purpose. So you feel me? What my purpose actually is. So I can serve my purpose and get the fuck up out of here. You feel me? Because I don't want to be on this bullshit ass earth. Everything they make on here is set for you to fucking fail. Everything, literally. You want to become a rapper, you get famous, and then you end up in jail because you a hood ass nigga. You feel me? You got all the money in the world, but you can't get yourself out of jail still? Set up. Set up, you feel me? So let me tell y'all niggas how Amazon set me up. Damn, it's hot as a bitch in here. Hold up. Gotta fuck open the window. Damn. So I want to tell y'all niggas how Amazon set my ass up. You feel me? I made a video recently and I told y'all I got fired from Amazon, but I didn't explain what actually happened. So let me tell y'all niggas what really happened of how I got set up. Long story short, man. I'm going to say the facts and that's it. Nothing in between. Long story short, new manager, he doesn't like me. I could tell. Everybody told me about him. He was an asshole. He comes on the scene, you know, for the whole month I was working, you know. I could, I've been working at Amazon for a year plus, but this month, this particular month, I was, they kept moving my station back and forth. Every time I went to a station, they moved me to another station, moved me to another station, moved me to this station. So this particular day, you know, I was working, then boom, I got moved to another station. You feel me? Working again, then boom, I got moved to another station. That's twice now. Go to break. You know, I'll take a break. You feel me? It's break time. Come back from break. Guess who's at my fucking station? The manager. His name is Tom. You know, he, he had it out for me. He wanted me gone. I could tell. You know, he's at my station waiting for me. Oh, yeah, Kevin, Um, we're going to do some moving around here. Boom, move you to another station. Now, this station that he moved me to, there's some, I get there, there's somebody already there. Correct? So I can't work on that station, right? Correct? So what do I got to do now? I got to go find the manager and tell him there's somebody at that station. Let me get another station. So, boom, I leave that fucking station. Now I'm looking for a manager. There's four of them, bro. Four of them. Now, all of a sudden, I can't find not one of them. Set up. Can't find not one of them. Usually, I will always see at least one of them walking around somewhere. Couldn't find one, well, not one of them, you know. So, I'm waiting at, a, at an area called stand-up, you know, where the managers usually come over, you feel me, to, you know, do some work and, you know, answer some questions or something. They, they just come over there. That's their little chill spot. I'm waiting at their chill spot. Nobody pulls up. You know, nobody comes looking for me, you know. I'm asking other associates, yo, bro, you see the, you seen the manager? Like, I'm just like, I ain't got no work. Like, what the fuck? I got no station. I can't work right now. Like, what's good? Like, you seen one? You know, one associates, all these niggas trying to help me out. I know I'm only asking people that I know because I'm not about to ask a fucking stranger I don't know. You feel me? So, you know, one of them actually helped me out. He's like, yo, bro, check on third or fourth floor because those floors is fucked up right now. So check on those floors. They might be up there. You know, I'm going to thank you, bro. So I go to fourth floor. I finally find one, you know. I've been on fourth floor a couple times already. They still wasn't there. But I go on fourth floor this time. I finally find a manager. I'm happy. Yay. Yo, bro, let me get a station. I have, I've been walking around without a station looking for you guys, for, you know, for a little minute now. Can I get a station? The station y'all sent me to, there was a person at it. Let me get a new station. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. That's crazy. All right, go here. Go to this station. Hurry up. Hurry up. Who the fuck is you talking to? I ain't no dog. This is a big ass building. I'm walking from the north side to the south side constantly. <laughs> yeah, okay. So, anyways, I walk my ass to that station. Guess what? Guess what? Guess what the problem with that station? <clears throat> no, no. There's nobody there. There's nobody at that station. Guess what? The station doesn't have a scanner. I can't scan myself in to show that I'm at the station. I can't do that. I can't work without the scanner. So now this. Station that they sent me to got another problem. I'm fed up at this point. You know, I'm sick at the time. You know, I'm walking back and forth. You know, I got a cold, a headache. I'm like, fuck, son. So, you know, what's the most logical thing to do? Instead of chasing these fucking managers around, you know, I take myself to HR, which is called Human Resources, 
and they supposed to help you. You feel me? That's really what, what they're there for, to help you. Them motherfuckers is never there. Never, nigga. You need some help, you feel me? You want to go snitch on, some, on, on somebody? I ain't no snitch. I ain't about to snitch. But you, you need some help because, like, you know, they take you hours away for, for some bullshit reason or something. Or you just, you just want to, you know, you try to leave because your girlfriend pregnant or something. Da, da, da. You know, you usually go there to go tell HR so you can leave the building or something, but you got an emergency. But guess what? They're never going to be there. They never are. Never are there to help you. So what do I do next? Somebody come help me. Oh, yeah. HR? They might be in their office. Okay, let me go to their office. I go to their office. Guess what now? They didn't even have the audacity to open the door. They had no respect to open the door for me. I knock on the door. Yo, I need help. They eat it. Oh, yeah, we'll be at the desk. We'll be at the desk. They didn't even open the door, yelling at me through the window. We'll be, we'll be at the desk. Okay, I'll go back to the desk where they're supposed to be at. I'm waiting. Somebody else come help me. It's an assistant manager. Oh, yeah, what are you waiting for? Who are you looking for? HR. Oh, yeah, they're, not, they're probably not going to come out till break time. Um, yeah, I don't think it's a good idea to wait here. Let me help you out. Let me see what's the problem. What happened? Oh, yeah, I've been looking for a manager, you know, because I had no station. They keep sending me to bad stations that don't work. Yeah, can, can you help me get a manager? Oh, yeah, let me, let me get on my laptop. Let me send a manager over here. Oh, yeah, he's coming over here. Yeah, yeah he's coming. Boom. Guess, who, guess what manager comes? Tom. Oh, yeah, t Tom comes. Oh, man, what happened? I was looking for you. What? I was looking for you, Tom. What are you talking about? Oh, no, no, no. Man, listen, you can't be walking around, man. Walking around. I'm trying to work. I'm you. I was working perfectly fine, but you moved my station. I don't know why you keep moving my station. Now I couldn't find not one of you guys. I was trying to look for you guys so I can work. Oh man, I'm I'm just saying, man. I only moved you twice. No, you moved me four times. You feel me? And you're about to move me again, unless you don't give me VTO. Cause I'm asking for VTO at this point. VTO means voluntary time off. That means you can leave. You know, I'm asking for VTO so I could, so I could leave. I haven't been working for like over an hour now, you know? Oh, he's like, okay, no, no, there's no VTO, there's no VTO. Da, 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 da. You know what? Go to this station. Go to this station over here. Go to another station, you know? Oh, there's somebody up there, you know? But, the, you know, there's, now there's a manager with me. He's like, oh, yeah, sir, you got to move, da, da, da. You feel me? He has to work on this station, you know? Now, now they want to move people because I can't move people. I need a manager to move people from the station. So now I'm working. I'm thinking everything all fine and dandy. Thinking everything good, right? Then boom. Oh, yeah, Kevin, you need that HR. For what? <laughs> Shit, I don't know, man. <laughs> Nigga, no damn well why they need me at HR. If somebody comes to you with Amazon, they say they need you at HR, that means you about to get fired. I already knew what the fuck it was. I went to HR. They, like, sit in this room, close the door. Like I'm in jail, like I'm in so like like uh, like I'm in timeout. Now then, then guess what? Tom is there. Oh yeah, we so we just want to talk about what happened. You know, uh, why he wasn't working for like two hours. Nigga, I couldn't find a manager. Oh yeah, that's T O T. That means time off task. Oh yeah, that's 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 T O T. Uh yeah, you're terminated for that. What? What? Oh yeah, some someone who wants someone who wants to work, you know. They, 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 they will try harder. What? I've been working here for a year plus. Through peak season, 11 hour shifts, working overtime six days out the, out the week. And you gonna tell me I don't wanna work? Get the fuck out of here, nigga. You feel me? Get the fuck out of here. And this, is, and this is why I got fired, bro. That's really why I got fired, bro. Because I couldn't find a manager in time. I couldn't find a manager in time, pretty much. Could not find a manager. So you know what? I appealed it. I appealed my termination. You know? So I can get reemployed and shit. I don't know if that's gonna work for me. It should. Cause they fired me for some bullshit reason. You know? A nigga need some income to, to keep coming in. I ain't trying to collect unemployment, but I will if I have to. But I I wanna let y'all know the, the bullshit reason why I got fired. Now let me know how you feel about that. You feel me? I don't even care how you feel. Cause I know it's some bullshit. It's a setup. It's a setup, man. Clearly, it's a setup. The guy might be racist. The guy might have something against me. You feel me? There's a lot of black people that got fired from Amazon recently. 
a lot of blacks. Be careful, bro, if you work for Amazon. Gang, gang, bang, bang.